Welcome YouTube, this is your host Danny Lotion, let's continue Star Wars. I'm having a ton of fun playing this um, game, it's been very interesting. So let's continue, this is a live stream, recorded video will be on YouTube, if you are watching this on YouTube, show me some love, I'm trying to grow the channel, if you do enjoy it, um, feel free to like and subscribe, and here we go. Okay, so we had, give me one second here, let me get my bearings here, all oh, right, right, look at that man, so we had run into the night sister, right, and um, let's see here, Sorry, I was just trying to get to the right uh, location here. So like I'd like to do at the start of the stream, go to the chapter. So we had run into the night sister in the last part and Cal wanted to cooperate and say hey you know I'm not your enemy and uh, that didn't go well so so that is the uh, I want to say it should be we did the origin tree all that kind of stuff let me see here we came back to because we came back to Dathomir right and uh, let's see here. Okay. Yeah, so the Zepho is right there. So Cordova found a Zepho Astrium three years before and a Zepho tomb on Dathomir might hold another. And um, so that's where we're at. We're back on Dathomir and we will see what secrets it holds for us to get this Astrium. Ooh. Hello. Yeah, that's probably a shortcut back, right? You can kind of tell right there. Come here, yo. Whoa. Okay. Oh, shoot. Didn't want to do that. Okay. Now you're on the run, aren't you? Come here. Yeah. Yeah. BD's happy. So I was trying to do a pull on the person above. See if we can do that. Cleaned. Oh. The Night Brother Archer. Dodge unblockable charged energy bow projectiles. Deflect, reflect normal shots from energy bow. Dodge unblockable charged energy bow projectiles. 
Reflect, reflect, normal shots from energy bow. A society of male warriors, the Night Brothers are a subspecies of Zabrax based on the Dathomir. For centuries, their society existed in loyal reverence to the Night Sisters, witches that ruled the planet but were decimated during the Clone Wars. Extreme hostile to outsiders, Night Brothers are skilled fighters proficient with a variety of weapons. Among their ranks may be found archers capable of launching ranged energy bow attacks with deadly accuracy. All right, good to know. What about that dude down there, man? Were we supposed to like scan that person? The one who was like coming at us strong. Um, or is that gone now? Yeah, that person's gone, okay. Yeah. Man. I always like to look at the photo mode, right? And see <clears throat> the view. Amazing. Amazing. Okay. All right, there's a path over here. There's a path over there. Hold on, let me see here. Multiple ways. Unexplored. I think this is the one where we... Wait a minute, can I zoom out and see where... Which way is the destination? Find the A-stream on Dathomir. Okay. Let's just go and check this side out. Whoa, whoa, whoa. There's somebody here. Right there, you see that? It's an ambush. Outsider! Yeah. Yeah? Oh, dang it! That attack. Oh, man. Caught me off guard there. I was trying to use BD to gain some health, but it's all good. It's all good, yo. Okay, here we go again. Down there. I understand. Move forward. Stop him from moving. Okay. Yeah, that's how we roll, yo. Stim beady. I will avenge my brothers. Yeah. I think we've already scanned it, so this game's smart about that. I will strike you. Come on. Where is your skill? Yeah, now we get to scan it, okay. Night Brother Warrior. Skilled and nimble, strong defense is advised, including mindful opportunities to strike. Yeah, meaning mindful, meaning force, which is what we were doing. Dodge their unblockable overhead attack. Night Brothers are a male warrior subspecies of Zabrax based on death and four centuries. Their sim the simple society was governed by Night Sisters, watched witches that ruled. Didn't we just read this for the other one? Territorial and extremely hostile to outsiders. Yeah, ranks are highly acrobatic. Fighters in their ranks are highly acrobatic, agile, and proficient in variety of mixed combat. Okay. I think it's kind of the same. Nice job. It reminds me of the Mad Max, you know, the like the Valhalla and those enemies. Okay, wait a minute. What about that other door, though? That was on the other side. 
Yeah, that door. Okay, let's go check that door out too. Maybe we can't open this yet. Yep, okay, door is locked from the other side. Good. Wait, what is this? Is this glowing blue? No. Okay. It's like... I bet you, uh, like I said, that God of War, the 2018. God of War had like similar things, like you could just slide it, Curtis could roll into it and it breaks. Whoa, man, look at this view. Stop! Come here! Hey, you come here, bro. Another one. Man, they're loaded in this area. I won't let you flee. What are you doing, Cal? Jeez. His shield just went back up. Ooh. Yeah. Let's see what we got. <laughs> New Mantis paint, huh? Which one? Ooh, that's kind of cool. Yeah, let's do it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Maybe I can do something. Okay, let me think. There must be something here we can climb. Maybe we can pull them. Jeez. What the hell is going on? Goodness gracious. That did not go as planned. Okay, hold on. Should be able to oh wall jump. I have to wall jump. Okay. What the F What the F? I mean this is pretty bad, like they're like right there. Right here, BD. He's recovering. Attack! Oh god, let's see. That's a dead end. So we're gonna have to climb there. What, do another wall jump on the other side? think. Oh, I can throw my lightsaber. Hold on. 
Uh, where is that? Okay, I keep forgetting there are all these moves, right? Uh, where was the one where we can throw it? Okay, let's look at the skill tree. Hmm. Cal throws his lightsaber forward before pulling it back to him, hitting any enemies along the way. Didn't I already do that though? Attacking out of a sprint allows Cal to perform a special lightsaber attack. Maximum force is increased. I think it's this one. Three points, man. Cal throws his lightsaber forward before pulling it back. Okay, what is this one? Range of lightsaber throw. Ah, oh, select that. I want to see it. Of course, we can't learn it because we're not at a meditation spot. Cal throws his lightsaber forward before pulling it back to him, hitting any enemies along the way. What if it's only forward and not upward, right? Hmm. I don't want to waste three skill points just for that. It's freaking, I just only got one stim left, man. These dudes are brutal. Yep. You cannot defeat our might. You pay outsider. Yeah. We have to be quick, quick about it. Be super quick. There's like these corners, man. We gotta be careful. Uh, okay. Is this gonna come crashing down on us or what? What did I tell you? Wait. Whoa, 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 whoa! Oof. That was close, man. That would have not been fun. Although we've killed everybody, but still. Should I be going down to save? Nah, because they're all going to revive again. Whoa, dude, there's spiders. Oh my god, spiders and this dude? This game's brutal, yo. Where's the shortcut I'm looking for? I thought there was a... Wait, where did that meditation spot go? Hmm. One that we saw from a distance. Oh, okay, we're not there yet, I guess. Where is that? There it is. Oh shit, I always forget that. The little splatter at the end. Goodness gracious. Wanna look inside? See what you found. New lightsaber switch acquired, okay. Man, oh man. Wait. That thing was spewing out something. Please man, give me a meditation spot. Okay, thank you. There we go. Shortcut unlocked, yep. That's good, but I don't want to just meditate and then... But if I don't meditate, then I have an opportunity to pretty much get killed. 
and I only got one stim. I wonder where the next one is. I'm gonna have to fight all these enemies again, man, if I do this. Uh, what happened to Poe? Oh, okay, I was like, what happened to the door? Hmm. Decisions, decisions. Ah, screw it. We need the stems, man. Oh, there's a... Wait, can I climb that to get to the... Ooh, can I climb that to get there? No. Can I? Okay, let's explore this before we respawn all these enemies. Let me just make sure how do I get to that real quick. Maybe there was a pathway on the right here. I missed. Missed something here? No, I did not. Okay. Maybe I can pull something now. Can I swing over there? Nope. Alright, let's meditate and we're gonna book it. We're just gonna run through the shortcut. Enemies have respawned. Alright, let's run. What is it doing? It's forgotten how to fight because I pulled it into this area, see? New lightsaber sleeve acquired. Okay. You picked up a new switch, right? Where is it? I wish it would highlight it. Magus, I think, was the one. Yeah, I don't know if I like that. I think the way I have it is okay.
Wait, am I supposed to be going here though? Probably. Our fellow wanderer. Oh shit. I see you met the resident night sister, but uh, unlike most, you're alive. <laughs> what well, lightsaber? No, no, don't hide it. That would explain your survival. Who are you? you no, no, no one to fear. <laughs> Just a traveler, studying the nature of extinct cultures and dead philosophies. You study the Night Sisters? I study many things. But yes, that Night Sister. Oh, she was only a child when the war came to this world. She had to watch her whole family perish. What do you know about those ruins? Oh, oh. Ancient beyond belief. The Night Sister and her warrior kin were seduced by the power that lurks within. Avoid the ruins. Or suffer the same thing. Strangers, after landing on Death America, Cal and BD1 faced off against a Night Sister who demanded they leave the planet immediately. When they refused, she commanded Night Brothers to attack them. Shortly after escaping that threat, Cal and BD1 came upon a wanderer who claimed to be studying Zephyr ruins. Who he is and what's become of the Night Sister remains to be seen. Again, this planet is a lot about illusion and stuff, right? Is what we learned at the very start of this. So one thing to keep in mind is, is this like an illusion? Or is this uh, really something that Cal is witnessing, right, so to speak? So just, uh, you know, just something to keep in mind. All right. Pretty impressive though, right? This person's uh, face, right? I just want to point this out. Like when, I don't know if this is purposely done, but the the facial features, I should say, the facial features. Evan McGregor, who played in episode one, two, and three, the Jedi Master of the Young Padawan. His face looks very like Evan McGregor. You see that? I don't to me it does. How long have you been here? Long enough. This world provided a sanctum when I was in need. Shelter when I was weak. And enlightenment when I was lost in the dark. <laughs> <laughs> right. I'll have to see who gave the voice for it. Do you know so much about the Night Sister? Observation. I've seen many things since coming here. What does that mean? Must it mean something? Too many great minds have gone astray in pursuit of... order. I gotta get going. <laughs> Beware. Dathomir's mysteries are many. Yeah. Very cool. Okay, let's go over here, see what's on this side. Oh shit. Move back, move back, move back. Okay. Oh, you bastard. Oh shit! Dang it! So I forgot. Skill point acquired. Okay, cool, cool. Man, look at this place.
Ah, uh, here we go. There's that place. Finally we made it. Maximum life increased. Something here. Energy from the ruins? Temptation. Someone was headed towards the ruins. I felt the pull of a dark ancient energy. Nice. Maximum life. I like it. Oh! Dang it. Oh, and we got a refill on our health and everything. Sure. Let's go, let's go. Let's head towards the ancient ruins, shall we? Let's see what we got. You got anything else to say? No? Okay, cool. Talk to you later. Oh, what is down here? Oh, never mind. Okay. That wasn't uh, helpful, but okay. What? Gotta be kidding me. Let's try this again. Okay. I see an intruder. You see nothing. Ah, I bleed for us. What the? Whoa! I was trying to push them off, but I guess I don't have that skill for multiple ones, right? So, but even one of them was not working. Interesting. Okay. What is this? Climbable. But not without equipment. Die! Oh my god. <sighs> Can't believe we made it. You sure know how to have fun. Okay, skill tree. Let's see what we got here. We've already got the max life increase, but we can probably even go further. Cal's maximum force is increased, and then there is on this side, Cal's maximum life is increased. And then there are these other ones. Powerful push along Caldus and groups of enemies flying and knock down large targets. Hold R2, yep. How many is that? Uh, two skill points, okay. Let me see. Wow, that's a lot. Let's see. Oh, okay, even that, huh? I can use some help in that one. Interesting. 
Okay, let's see how far we can make it without it right now. If we need to bump that up, we shall. Here we go. Oh my god. What the heck was that? Why is he medit- what? Why are you meditating, bro? Oh my god, okay, might as well. If we're gonna meditate, I don't know why that happened, but maybe it was because I slipped back into it. All right, let's be a little careful here. Jeez. These buggers are annoying. Door is locked from the other side. Oh, really? So where were we supposed to be heading then? Let's see here. Oh. There is a pathway there. Rope. No rope. Oh, shit. That startled me. I was like, what the hell? You will go no further. Stand aside. No. He was right about you. Who? What? Jedi are thieves and selfish liars who bring nothing but death. Back off. If you attack me again, I'll strike you down. Oh, I won't do a thing. But my murdered sisters. They will have their revenge. Told her What'd you find? that Jedi's are thieves. That's interesting. Undead Night Sister, relentless, able to leap and highly aggressive against her targets, attack in swarms, avoid becoming surrounded. Yep. So this is where I think the multiple push skill will come in handy. We'll invest in that soon. Few have seen an undead Night Sister and survived. It is believed these mummified warriors emerged from the burial pods of ancient Night Sister graveyards or on foul eaves or under command of a witch's incantation. They are known to be hostile to all life except their Night Sister masters. Upon sight of their prey, they release a piercing scream, calling all nearby undead. They attack in frenzied swarms, clawing and biting their way through flesh. Good to know. Okay. Okay, let me see here. Something else. If only she would just communicate and talk to Cal about maybe from a distance, you know? Wear a mask or something, yo. Jeez, if you're concerned about that. <laughs> you know. He ain't got no germs and shit, you know? So just wear a mask, you know? Just be safe. Safety first. Um, More undead. Oh, shit. Leave this place. Oh, shit. Can I get a stem PD one? Okay. 
care. Be careful, Cal. Okay, here we go. See, these are. Can they come from here? Give me a meditation spot, yo. Oh shit. Dang it. I can't see. Up here. Man, only two stims left. To fight them at this point, or can I just wall jump over? I'll just wall jump over, screw it. How does that night sister keep following us? Sierra called them force wielders, and I've never seen it used this way before. We better stay on our toes. Wait, do you have toes? <laughs> Idea what that flying creature is. Let's hope we don't find out. That was weird. What is this? Okay, I did not want that to happen one bit. Is this a shortcut or something? No, 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 no. Dude, why is he doing this first? Man, I went over there, man, not over here. Hey, BD, in here. Let's see what you found. New lightsaber sleep, power and control. Okay. Oh, this is the shortcut. Okay, now we can. Meditate, thank you very much, gang. Okay. Now we're gonna have to fight those annoying buggers again, but that's all good. Okay. I'm thinking... Man, it's a tough decision. I'm thinking that skill, where is this? Yeah, powerful... Push allowing Cal to send groups of enemies flying and knock down large targets. This is a good one to have, I think. Although I'll have to hold it, and the Night Sisters, the Undead Night Sisters, are pretty fast. So will I even get a chance to hold it in time? Now ah, screw it. Let's let's give it a shot, right? What the heck? It's only two skill points, I think. Yeah. Although even if I push all of them away, I still have to get to each one individually. Alright. Yeah, let's do it. What the heck. I would rather do the... Oh, actually, you know what? I could also do the one for throwing the lightsaber, right? Maybe? Let's see. Yeah, maybe that could be helpful too. Let's... Uh, L1 and triangle. Hmm. 
Hmm, I really like this skill. Gosh, I really want to try this one. It's only three. Okay, we can get, get another skill point pretty soon. So, yeah, let's just do the Howling Push. I think that will that should come in handy. Yep, there we go. That should be, yeah. So let's try it on the these little buggers here. It didn't work. What the f? What the heck, man? It was supposed to work, right? Again? It's, it took like half my health, man. Oh shit. What is going on? Oh, it's the poison, okay. Alright, let's try this one more time. Why didn't it push them away? Okay, let's see. Let them come to the side first, I guess. See? Still didn't work. Weird. Does it only work on humans? Shit. Bloodborne style, right? Shortcuts, little el wooden elevators, all that kind of thing. Okay, where? Okay, here we go. Let's be sneaky about it. Death of Mimirian Glyphs. Night Brothers paint glyphs using wait, Night Brothers paint glyphs using acid from the hydratis. Rather than staining the surface, the acid burns into even the hardest rock faces, leaving permanent marks. Interesting. Each uh, okay marks. Uh, that is uh, leaving permanent marks. That is pretty interesting, isn't it? Yeah. Each symbol must be carefully drawn, both to preserve accuracy. And avoid damage to oneself. Master calligraphers are rare and extremely valued for their talents. Really? I think we're getting close to a village. Okay, let's see if we can toss all these away. Ooh! I got a trophy for this. Send 25 enemies over the ledge. Oh, okay. That was good. See, that skill paid off already. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, Cal's like adjusting his hair. He's like, I'm pretty slick. I'm badass. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Now I can use the howling push to just take loads of enemies off. That was pretty cool, though. See? Oh, you bastard. Where did you come from? Gosh, I hate those. point acquired haha -ha. so now we can also get the throwing skill okay let's take care of these jokers here first you 
cannot defeat our mother. Prepare to die, outsider. Oh, freaking, there's an army coming. Okay, they're going back. See that? That's what I was like referring to the army right there. It's like a bunch of them. I want to get this stuff here first. Wanderer, angry. Someone was hunted here. It was a wanderer, right? The Knight Brothers were chasing someone through the swamp, someone they feared. Maybe the Wanderer is the one with the dark energy. Oh shit, there's two ways to get to? Oh no, okay. What is this glowing thing? Nothing. Oh shit, that is a pretty strong attack, man. Oh my god. What are you doing, Cal? Jeez. Oh shit, what happened? Oh. Damn it! Help, BD. Can I like bounce its attacks back to it? Oh shit. Okay, I can, I can. I keep forgetting. Okay, sorry. That was um my bad. Always finding stuff. Spider domestication. Night Brothers, uh, spider domestication. Night Brothers only recently began efforts to domesticate the Bane back spider without the Night Sisters' magical anti venoms. The task has occasionally proven deadly. However, it, if a spider is captured young and raised alongside a Night Brother, it will bond with him and become a lasting companion. That is awkward, but okay. I keep forgetting I can use the lightsaber to bounce the laser attacks back. There's a lot of moves in this game and the move sets is like intense. Okay, now what? Is this a door or something or what? No. Oh wait, there's something up there? Okay, so how do I get up there? Oh, I see, okay, there's something there. Right here, yeah. Mm. 
Finally, thank you. the dude down there. He didn't respawn? Okay, that's good. I'm just trying to see if... Uh I want to invest in those. I was thinking about if I want to invest in that other skill, but no, I think no, I'm good for now. The one that but throwing the lightsaber, I think I'm okay though. All right, here we go. Turn back, Jedi. gonna have our undead sisters come out again okay feels like a boss fight or something around here as soon as we jump down that's why they give us that meditation spot right okay let's see it okay What is it not working? Dang it. Didi, I need help. Need assist. Shit. Oh my god. Didi, here. Oh my god. Help BD. Something interesting? That lesser Nidak. Uphold a strong defensive defense against its aggressive and relentless attacks. Easily thrown off by repeated parries. Oh, parries, okay. I didn't even think about it. Uh, refer to in legend as the Scrooge of Dathomir, the deadly lesser Nidak is an agile and highly aggressive alpha predator. Its carnivorous appetite and relentless pursuit of a prey of prey make it a deadly foe to nearly all other life forms. Powerful arms allow it to traverse terrain in diverse and unparalleled methods, often surprising its quarry. Okay, next time we will. Be mindful of the parry. The lair of the Nidak. The lesser Nidak is a feared opponent. For, the lesser Nidak is a feared opponent for Night Brothers. Though legends say, say some Night Sisters kept them as familiars. Nidaks are solitary creatures rarely seen in packs after adolescence. Their only natural predator is the massive Gorgara. Hmm. Okay, I guess uh, I am. I mean, part of me wants to think that we can go back to the meditation. No, probably not. Okay. Oh, here we go. What is this? Sound psycho. Okay. Okay, yeah, it was the night. To set an example. Night brothers were thrown into a pit, killed by beasts, no doubt to set an example. Okay. 
Okay. Okay, so we have to probably take it to that side. Yep, to climb... Which side? What's with the music, yo? We got another attack coming? What? What? Hold up, man. We should be climbing this area, I think. spot There, the meditation. What the? Oh shit, that's not good, that is really not good. I don't think I can fight all of them, man. I passed by the gate. Oh shit! No, 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 this is not good, man. If I freaking die now, it's gonna spawn me all the way back. Son of a bitch. I've caught you, outsider. Where do I go? Oh my god, not good, not good. <laughs> Shit, I need to climb. Oh freaking A! Not good, not good, not... See what I mean? That was brutal, man. That was just... R1 slowed enemies are vulnerable to attack. Oh, I keep forgetting the R1 too. If it spawns me all the way back to the Nidak, that's just gonna be... messed up. I think that's what it did. Yep, that's exactly what it did. So I'll have to fight the Nidak again. It's okay, I guess. Or maybe... It's, it doesn't... I cannot give... If it makes me fight it, I mean it's good practice I guess in a way, but... Jeez. Oh, Let's see. 
Yep. There we go. Now we get to parry it. Duck. What is it doing, man? I cannot do my attack. What? Gosh. That's not cool, man. I still use the same amount of stems. Stems, I mean. Got something to help me? It's all good. Better than before, I guess. Okay, let's give this another go. What? That's how we roll, yo. I was this close, right? Right before that jump. Okay. This close. In the previous uh, one, the jump didn't come through, but we made it. We made it. It's all good. Okay. So, let me just make sure. Just to be on the safe side, I am going to rest. And I'm not going to invest in any skill points, I think, at the moment. And so what we're going to do is, I think you all know, we'll use this as a stopping point. So thanks for tuning in. What an amazing journey that Cal is on right now. And we will continue the next part. Catch you in the next one.